Hello everybody, this is at Zoo, and this is part 7 of Sonic Hedgehog CD. This should be the final part because this is the final zone. <laughs> I need to think of better ways to introduce the final part to games. The way I'm doing it now is not really that epic. Eh. But anyway, let's get started, shall we? This is Metallic Madness. It's a typical uh, machinery, base like zone, final zone. Kind of like Scrap Brain Metropolis, Death Egg Zone. But, yeah, this is pretty hard. This is pretty trickily laid out here. You won't need some platforming prowess to not get hit. You shouldn't die, but you will get hit quite a few times. But yeah, but since, and since we killed Metal Sonic and started Speedway, yeah, we killed Metal Sonic. <laughs> why? <sighs> So that's why we don't have to worry about the Metal Sonic hologram here. We still have, we only have to get the robot monitors here. The robot monitors are pretty well hidden here. You will have to do some looking around to find them. They are pretty well they are pretty well hidden. This first one is the, the, the first they are pretty well hidden, both of them. If you do it wrong you won't miss them both easily. They're pretty easy to miss. But I usually jump there because you'll run into an enemy if you don't jump there. It's a good idea to jump. Press X to not die. Yep, this is the pass. Now, Metallic Madness, it, both Metallic Madness and Sword of Speedway would make me want to shoot the U.S. soundtrack in the face. This is what I was afraid of. This, hap this is happening. Just look at that. Well, I sort of glitched that, but you saw what was happening there. That's what I ate. There's a speed shooter. I'd like a shield, please. A shield would be most helpful to have. Get a shield, please. Uh, I hate this. 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 I hate not having a shield. This is Danger McDanger Pants. Danger McDanger Town. Okay, let's try to backtrack it. No. I know. I saw what you're trying to do. Spring. Come on to you. So, yeah, the robot monitor's not for a while yet, so I'm just kind of Danger McDanger Town here. Uh, shield, 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 shield. Thank you. Thank you. So I am protected now. I protected my hedgehog. And we're at the beginning of the act now. You may there's an extra life spawn there. Great. I don't know, did I miss it? Did I miss it on the present? I may have I may have accidentally missed it. Oh well, it's only one life. One life. And I don't think I'm gonna die sixty three times. It's highly unlikely that I'm, well, I'm gonna die that much. <laughs> but yeah, so let's go up this way. It's Danger Town up here. So the robot monitor is a bit, it's a bit of a ways. Yes. Yeah, watch out. That spring will spring you up into the, into the spikes if you're not careful. Let's go hop, hop along the frog here. Hop along in this way. Yes. Let's get some rings here. We don't want to sound this upper path for too long, though, so let's go back down here, this way. The, low, the lower paths are more danger town, so you got to be careful. So we're going to get more rings. That's why I'm backtracking. That's why you love me. You like my backtracking. I'm the best at backtracking. I'm the best all around. Yeah. So this is danger town here. Danger McDanger town. You got to be careful. There's rings down here. Thank goodness that wasn't a bottomless pit or I would have died. Yep. Watch out for these. These are danger. The metallic mass is just whole old danger town here. It's pretty. It's, it's, you wouldn't want to live here. It's pretty dangerous. <laughs> but yep. Let's say let's get these rings. I'll try not to die. Unless you're playing super size salary man, then you want to die. Whoa, 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 whoa. See, that's a jerk move right there. That, that's a jerk move right there. That's really hard to dodge, and I just barely got away with it. Now, this will suck coming back up, but yeah, you need to be in the past here. It's the only way to get that, get, get that, go down here. See, this sucks. See, you need some precision here. Precision. Dang, this is a dangerous place, man. Said you wouldn't want, like I said, you wouldn't want to live, live here. This is Danger Town. It's like Danger Town. 
So here's the robot monitor. Now we just gotta finish the act about getting hit again. Okay, it, sh it should be safe if I fall here. But yeah, danger. Danger town. Okay, I was pretty close, so I'm just gonna do this. Now this is gonna suck trying to get back up here. Yeah, angle, I angled that right. Oh, I angled this right too. I've got these 20 rings are up here. I angled that just right. Right, 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 right. I hate that part so much. I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. That's a jerk move right there. It couldn't have placed that in a more jerkish spot. Seriously. Why do they have to place it there? It's a really jerk move. They couldn't have placed it in a worse spot. <sighs> Dang it, game. You're giving me heart attacks. I was trying not to die. 200 rings would be would be good if I get there. But I'm just trying not to get hit. I burned my shield already. But this is kind of danger town. The like danger town here. Yep, I'm not going to go that way. I'll take you. I choose you, Spring. So we can backtrack a little and get some rings. Here, be careful not to hit these, just like the ones from earlier. Do not hit those. No. So, try to get some rings here. Come on, come on, come on. Appear. I command you to appear. I command you to appear. So this is this is some tricky platform. The upper path is the least dangerous, but you do have to do some pretty good platforming. I'm not going back any further. I hate those things so much. Those things can go die, really. There's Danger McDanger Town. <laughs> hey, let's go forward. Metallic Madness makes me nervous. The final zones of all games, other than Triple Trouble, Sonic Destroyer is really easy. But it just makes me nervous. Like no other. No other. The final levels of any Sonic game make me nervous like no other. Yeah, because they're so dangerous, you get hit really easily. Okay. Uh, okay, I would like those rings, if I can. Now, these saw blades are not fun. Do not hit them. Bad touch. Uh, uh -huh. Oh, we're just short of 200 rings. Two rings would be good if I can get them. Oh. Oh, screw this. This is making me nervous. Two rings. <laughs> I hate this zone so much. It's good, but it gives me many heart attacks. I don't know. We might not even break a, a million. We might get pretty close, but we not might not break it. That depends on what happens in Act Two, Act Two and Three. As these two things will give us a good bit of change here. So this is the last time I'm going to fail this stage on purpose. Last time. Failing on purpose. So act 2 is where I'm going to get it, finally. <sighs> Talic Madness, you give me heart attack. Oh, I forgot, on the last one we'll get a time bonus, so that might actually be enough to push us over. <sighs> We're getting close. So, I'll see you, I'll see you on Act 2. See you on the flip side. Cookie Act Two, the final regular the regular act of the game, the final regular act of the game with the goal post. If you haven't got all seven time stones by now, it's your last act to do so. If you've been, if, if, also, if you've been wondering why I've been neglecting, been saving the seventh time stone for this act, please refer back to Palm Tree Panic. I explain it there. But yep, it's your last chance to get everything. Final zone. So you have to get this. You have to roll into it. That uh, served no purpose. Now we don't. We didn't really need to get that. But uh, oh, we got it. But uh, this is this, this is probably the hardest act in the game. Well, considering that is the final zone. You know, acts one and two are pretty hard. It's a kind of draw between them. So which one's the hardest? They're both pretty close. So yeah, let's go. Let's get our pack, posting get some rings. 
Now, you can time travel here, but I don't like to do it here. You'll see why in a little bit. What I do is that I ride one of these rings here for a time warp. I just ride one of these. It's safer. Put it that way. And there we are. We're in the past. Yay. Our final time warp to the past. Sad. It's the last one. I remember, I just remember being on Palm Tree Panic not so long ago. Uh, here's why I, why I don't like to go this time warp here. You'll end up in that pit down there with a big bomb. So yeah, so that's a little bit of a dangerous place to time warp here. Let's get rid of this so we don't accidentally time warp here. Rah. Go down here. Ooh, lots of platformy platformies. A couple extra rings. And we're at the beginning of the act, so let's continue forward now. The robot monitor is pretty close to the beginning of the act, actually. So we're going to go get that right now. You gotta, gotta watch out, because there's a big guy right here. So you gotta stand in the right spot so you don't get hit by any of these. Crap, I can't get those now. So what you do is that... Well, you can, you can go this way and get some extra rings. Be sure not to fall down too far, or you won't be able to come back up. So yeah, so you can get the, you get these rings. So let's, let's go. Yep, this won't make you travel. So at this intersection, you go left here, and just fall down on the side here. So the robot monitor is here with a, with a good bit of rings. There's a lot of ring boxes here. And here we are, the robot monitor. That's the final robot monitor. If you've done everything I showed you, you should get the Savior of the Planet trophy right by now. I don't know if it activates when you get the, get the final robot monitor until you beat the game, I'm not sure. But if you followed my uh, Let's Play LP, you should be able to have 100%. That's, and that's also the main reason why you want to leave that this last time stone for this act. It is a risky strategy, but you need to do it if you want if you want it. You also get the best ending by doing this. So, yep. So since we destroyed all the enemies, now we just need to worry about the hazards of the stage. So let's take it slow. Slowy, slowy, slowy. So well, we need to go slow here so we don't have to uh, not get hit. A shield would be very helpful, really. It would. I really love a shield. Please, game. I'll love you forever. I'll love you a long time if you give me a shield. I'm just gonna burn this in this hallway. I don't want to want to accidentally time travel. Okay, take it slow and steady. Okay, there's another future post. Oh, there's a ring right there. Fine. I'll just burn it off again. Burn off these excess calories, unwanted calories. There we are. That way, if we don't accidentally do it. Yeah, that's gimmicky. You flip between the foreground and the background. Yeah. So, let's go. So, there's nothing down this way. It's just death if you're not careful. You just die if you're not careful. Not a good present. Yeah, the, the gimmick here is that there's a, it's the second half of this act is a long maze, and you have to find your way through it. If you're not careful, you'll end up back in this big area out here. But but to get some of the items, you need to, to get some of the rings, you need to do that, though. So. so I'm going to do a little trick here. Oh, I screwed up the trick. I'm going to do a little tricky trick here. Dang it. The game will let me do it. There we are. Right. So watch out for the big guy there. So if I screwed up, if I would if I would have I would have landed on the spikes, I wouldn't have moved. So hold left here. You'll end up here. So you wanna go down here. Um uh, I forget which way to go here. Sound seems appropriate. Oh, um, wasn't I just here? Honestly, I, I don't know where I'm going now. <laughs> Let's go back to where we were. That sounds like a better idea. Uh, 
Let's go up these. Dang it, game. Dang it, game. And we don't have time for this. We don't have time for your nonsense. Okay, I won't make I won't make it from there. So let's go this way. Let's try this again. Yes, perfect. That's where I wanted to go. So you want to go up this way. And this, the entrance to the maze is somewhere around here. Here we are. You're tricky. Oh no 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 no. That's Danger Town. You can you can jump over this final wall up here if you get a good start up here. You, you can sort of skip a big chunk of this. See if you would have got a good enough start. But nope, we're gonna do this the right way. And we gotta kinda have to hurry now. It's gonna take a bit of time to get through this maze. Just trying to get hit. I hate those big bombs, they suck. Okay, don't jump. Don't jump. I gotta tell myself to not jump or I will jump. Oh, another one of these guys. Dang it, I hate these guys. So we're about to enter the maze here sh shortly. In, in a moment. Ah, uh, screw it. It's not worth it to get those two rings. They're both spikes. Not good. So these two hourglass type thingies. You want to hop, alternate hopping on them. Then you get them over there. And guess what? There's another big guy here that you got to avoid. So that's fun. So instead of trying to dodge him, I just go back here, respawn this, and do this again. It does eat up a bit of time, so you do have to hurry. So I might have to r start rushing here. Try to run out of time. We're about to enter the... Here's the maze. The shrinky way. You shrink. And look, isn't Sonic so cute? Oh, he's so cute. He looks like a chibi. He's so cute. Oh. Mini Tails looks even more cuter. So cute. You can still do the peel out. You look kind of strange when you do the peel out because you have the, the, the big anime eyes. Now, if you're tricky, you can skip. You can skip a good chunk of this maze by going up this way. You can get a good enough start. But yeah, but I'm gonna I'm gonna go through this proper. I'm gonna have to rush, rush a bit. I only got 90 seconds left. So I'm, I'm gonna start r rushing, starting to concentrate. Ah. Go, 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 Sonic, go. We don't have time, we don't, we, don't have, we don't have too much time to goof around. Ugh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Da -dee -da -dee -da -da -da. I should be able to make it. Come on, Sonic. No, another one of these guys. Should be the last one. There we made it. Huzzah. So yeah, don't go left. Because you have to go through this maze all that maze again. If you go that way. Yeah, don't go straight up. Yep. So this part. Stuff will fall. You have to jump on you have to go through the gaps. So yeah. Come on game, hurry up. Hurry up. Come on. Say again, don't go out that way. There, we made it. I thought I wasn't going to make it for a second, really. Shoo! It's cutting it close. I really thought I wasn't going to make it for a second. Shoo! That's pretty close. So now we're actually going to get the time stone here. We're actually going to get it. Huzzah! I bet you like, like that. Here, so I'm going to get my 160 rings. We're going to get a time bonus. We're going to get really close to 1 million points. Depending on how well I do this, I can see or make it or break it. Come on. There. Come on. Yes, 84. That'll give me a good bit of time bonus. So we got the final time stone at last. The green time stone, which is the best one. Green's the best color. So we got them all, finally. 
But we're getting dangerously close to one million here. We're probably not going to get there. We're probably going to end up somewhere around 990,000. Yeah. So I'll see you on the flip side for the finale. See you on the flip side. Okay, here we go. Act three. The final act of the game and the final showdown against Dr. Robotnik. Dr. Robonik. Dr. Robotnik. The final showdown. It's the final countdown. Yeah. The final frenzy. The final fever. Yeah, it's the final battle. It's the showdown. There are a hundred rings here, so I'm gonna try my best to get them all. But there's no score tabulation at the end of this, so I don't know why I'm getting them. I guess if you get all 100, you get one last extra life. We'll end with an interesting number, at least. So sad, though. So sad, bad dad. We're so close to a million points there. So close. If I would have grinded the angel statue on Lackey Workbench a bit more, I would have had it. So close, yet so far. I could have, should have, would have. Oh, well. Eh. At least, at least uh, my high score on the leaderboard is registered as, as a million. I'll take that. So if you're on PSN and have Sonic CD, you can always look that up. I'm not a liar. I, got, I did have over a million points. But this is, see, this is, this is McDanger Town here. This whole, this whole section in the middle takes place over a bottomless pit. So this is Mc, McDanger Town in the max here. The major McDanger Town. There's one more ring here. Yes. I got them all pretty quickly that time. It usually takes me a while because of the bouncy McBouncy bouncies. Yeah, this is really McDanger Town here. That went smoother than I thought it would. There's, they place a shield there that you can't possibly miss. You'll need it. Trust me, you'll need it. Let's go. I like this part. This part is pretty, really cool. I like this part. It goes black out and enemy fires and it lights up. This, this is a pretty cool part. I like this part. Pretty cool. See, I destroy three enemies here in, the, in these conditions. Here. That's a pretty cool part. I like this part. The uniqueness of Sonic CD. Right. So try to save your shield for, for Botnik. Try to do that. Yeah. There's the final two rings. That's time for the final fight. If you're playing on the Japanese soundtrack, you get some pretty cool music to go along with it. But since we're on the U.S. soundtrack, you just get the same old, same old music. So sad. Oh, well. This final fight is actually a bit more h harder than the rest. He only takes four hits, but it is a bit harder. Now, this first hit here, yeah, you have to go at it at a precise angle to hit him there. More, more, nine, nine times out of ten, you're going to take a hit there. It's almost unavoidable that you're going to take a hit there. If you don't take a hit there, you're amazing. Somehow I took a hit doing that. I wish I would have kept my shield. Dang it. I've got to be careful. He does have a different attack for how many panels he has left. So yeah. Sure. Last one. Come on. I'm trying to do this without getting hit. I like to keep my 100 rings. I like to keep all 100, please. Yeah. Got it. I kept them all. Yes. If I would have kept the score tabulation, I would have had over a million. Go figure. And we get to watch the ending cinematic. Huzzah. We get to hear the ending version of Sonic Boom. We don't get to hear Cosmic Eternity, but oh well. Again, if I do a Tales run of this, I'll play the Japanese soundtrack instead. Or if I decide to redux this. You can reach the other side of the rainbow. It's alright, take a chance, cause there is no circumstance that you can't handle when you use your mind. Yeah, Sonic Boom is good in a cheesy kind of way, both the beginning and the ending version. Yeah, so that was Sonic CD. Probably my favorite of the 2D Sonic games. So, what'd y'all think? Did I do good? Did I do some skillful play? 
at least. Hope so. Were you not entertained? Hope you were. So I'm doing this to entertain you. And now you can't see the ending sequence, but yeah. Sorry about that. I'm truly sorry about this. <laughs> but if you want to watch it, you can always look. You can always look it up. I guess. Sorry. But you're not watching this to watch the game. You're watching. You want to listen to my commentary, which I'm lacking. So you get to see the credits there. This is what this is what is originally. This is the original Sega CD credits here. Uh, so the end, the opening and ending Cinemax has some pretty good animation here, which you can't see. Sorry. I'm truly sorry. Sorry my equipment sucks. I try my best. At least you get to listen to Sonic Boom over my babbling, at least. Constellation Prize. Can't read it. Eh. I should have adjusted the camera. Oh well. Well, there's, there's the cool parts in the animation box that you can barely see. That I just did. So yeah, the anime and the animation just look like a quick tour of the seven zones, pretty much, and what you did there. And the final one it shows is Stardust Speedway against Metal Sonic. Yeah, Metal Sonic. If only you were real. I'm gonna stop there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We'll see you in Sonic for Episode 2, Metal. We'll see you in Sonic Heroes, Sonic for Episode 2, and Sonic Riders. Free Riders, at least. Yeah. That's the end of the... That's the end, end of the, end of the... Yeah, that's the end here. The Mega CD credits are... Original, original staff credits are going to end here, and it's going to sh show the credits here for the new version. And the song's going to extend here. This is not part of the regular song here. It's extended to fit the names of the staff, which you can't read, and sorry. It looks great. Yeah. That's the end of the original staff and song. Yeah. Yeah, the song was extended a little to fit, to fit them all in. And here's the final screen here, because we, we did everything. Yeah. Yes. Got it. And that's all you get. For doing if you did everything I did, that's all you get. Yeah. Worth it. But anyway, yeah, that was Sonic the Hedgehog C D. My favorite of the two D Sonic games. And I'm not gonna show you the leaderboards yet. If you really want to, I'll show you my time attacks as an ending. So you can see my hot times here. So Palm Tree Panic Act One, Act Two. Act 3, Collision Chaos, Act 1, Act 2, Act 3. Yeah, I kind of sucked on Collision Chaos and Palm Tree Panic. The rest I do a bit better in. I used to have the first place time on Title Tempest Act 1 a month back. I used to have the number one time. Act 2, Act 3. Act 3 is pretty hard to get a good run on. There, there's a bit of luck involved. So, Quartz Quadrant, Act 1. Act 2, Act 3, the Wacky Workbench, Act 1, Act 2, Act 3. The, yeah, you actually see a minute, over a minute time. Wacky Workbench Act 3 is the first plot act I went over a minute on. The Stardust Speedway, Act 1, Act 2, Act 3. Stardust Speedway Act 3 is a really hard to speed run because your, your Metal Sonic basically sets the pace. So yeah, this, this leaderboard is very cluttered around, around the same time. And finally, Metallic Madness. Act 1. Act 2. Act 3. Yeah. I think I did pretty good. My leaderboard time reflects it. And my grand total is 14 minutes, 24 seconds, 43 milliseconds, uh, hundredths of a second, cents of seconds. So I think it's pretty good. Sub 15 minutes. If I do perfectly, I can beat this game in 15 minutes. Here's my special stages. Zone 1 is 1423, Zone 2 is 1355, Zone 3 is 1360. Yeah, I'll, I'll go in here. There's Zone 1. There. There's Special Stage 2. Yeah. Special Stage 3. See, you can complete the Special Stages really fast. 
there's a difference between wanting to complete them fast and wanting to get a good score out of them. But yeah, you unlock the time, you unlock these these time trials if you get low enough. So if you did, if you followed my let's play exactly, you should be able to get all the trophies except one, all the trophies or achievements except one. The only one you need to do is the only one you can't get by watching me is my time. It's the time trials, and my total for the special stage is one minute fifty four seconds sixty six tenths of seconds. Pretty good. Cool. The, the only the other trophy you get is if your total for these are less than twenty five minutes, which as you can see I clearly did that. So we'll get everything. Maybe maybe I'll do some time trial runs down the line. Here's a bit of extras. You can see. You can see I got all, I got all the trophies. Got them all. Leaderboards, I don't know. I'm not online. I don't feel like having people bug me. I might show them another time. So again, it's a soundtrack. It's just so it's set up for me for next time. I'm going to switch to the Japanese soundtrack. There's a bit, there's extra mode. Visual mode, you get, you get to watch the opening, the good ending, the bad ending. You get a pencil test of the opening. See, look how much better this sounds. And unlike the original game, you have to you don't have to unlock sound test stage like in DA Garden separately. But yep, I guess I'm done screwing around here. Hope you enjoyed it. I may be showing more Sonic CD in the future, maybe. But until next time, I'll see you next time. Next up is Sonic 3D Blast. See you guys then.